The following contest is a tables match. And it's for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. The monster among men is here. Introducing the challenger, weighing in at 385 pounds, Ron Strowman. The earth is trembling with each step. Here's a man who won the greatest Royal Rumble in Jeddah, Saudi Arabia. He beat the bar at WrestleMania while teaming with a 10-year-old kid, and he won the Money in the Bank contract. Yeah, you start to feel like there's nothing Braun Strowman can't do. Well, there is one thing we know for a fact Braun Strowman can't do, and that is be stopped. The monster among men is unbelievable. represents the true personality of Shinsuke Nakamura. A man who feels he has freed himself from the weight of the WWE Universe. When Braun Strowman is out here, forget about reinforcing the ring. I hope someone contacted the local building department to reinforce this arena. And the oh, simple man. philosophy here is to stay as far away from the tables as humanly possible. Sounds easy, right? Wrong. The monster among men doesn't ask for permission nor ask for forgiveness. He simply destroys whatever lays in his path. Braun Strowman is a leviathan, Saxton. And sports entertainment has never experienced brute force like this from one human being. Ooh, what impact. Dominating shoulder tackle. This might be it. Oh, my. A torturous knee. Hooked him up. Oh, nasty impact. What a stop! Good grief! Oh my goodness, this hurts! Oh! Uh -oh. Find the star! Champ not looking good right now. This could be the start of an ugly downward spiral if he's not careful. Well, he had to expect to take some punishment tonight. You don't step in the ring with this guy and walk away completely unscathed. This is unreal strength. For everybody that can hear my voice, listen to what I'm about to say. There aren't too many men on this planet who can go toe-to-toe -to -toe with Shinsuke Nakamura and live to tell about it. Just don't do it. Ooh! Back suplex! Ooh. Very nice. Shinsuke Nakamura beginning to look a little uneasy. He can't be happy with how this is going right now. For somebody who walked into this match with so much confidence, he doesn't look so good right now. And if he's not careful, he's going to find himself put through a table very short. If there's one thing a superstar does not want to do, it's to attempt to match strikes with Shinsuke Nakamura. The king of strong style is an expert in a variety of fighting disciplines. 
Guys, we've talked about Nakamura's unmatched combat sports background. The first thing a superstar needs to do is begin to tirelessly study footage to figure out how to avoid going strike for strike with the king of strong style. Big time slam. Vicious. Oof. Oh, God, that hurt. Through Kofi Kingston's career, the exciting superstar has competed in several types of WWE matchups. It didn't take long for Kofi to get comfortable in the tables match environment. At 2011's TLC event, Kingston took on the Celtic warrior Sheamus in a tables match for the United States Championship. Kofi was impressive in the match as he combined defense with his unbelievable high-flying assaults. Look at this. There is absolutely no wasted motion in this attack. Byron, you spoke about Kofi Kingston's tables match against Sheamus at 2011's TLC event. Some people feel that match was one of the turning points for Kingston. That night, Kofi's usual fun-loving nature took a backseat to a more focused and offensively aggressive competitor. Kofi Kingston's focus was leaving TLC the new United States champion. And that approach paid off, Michael. Kofi seized opportunity when Sheamus made a rare mistake. He drilled the Celtic Warrior with the Trouble in Paradise kick, and that set up Kofi to fly from the top rope and put Sheamus right through the table to earn the United States Championship. I'll tell you right now, any kick from Nakamura can turn your lights out in an instant. But his finisher, the Kinshasa, could put your lights out for good. Nakamura's knees should be registered as lethal weapons. He's making a statement here with this attack. Oh, that's how you establish dominance. Sidewalk slam. Ooh, beautiful technique. Headbutt. Anyone who knows anything about Shinsuke Nakamura knows this man is a precision striker and accomplished grappler. When Nakamura hits an opponent with a Kinshasa, you can consider the match over. The force that Shinsuke Nakamura is able to generate to make the... Strowman. This is not going to be good at all. Oh, Braun Strowman slamming into the mat. Here's his moment, Michael. You gotta believe this one's over. Face buster. Boom, what impact. Oh, what a chop to the side of the face. He's done. Oh, what a hook. The oh, stop in the leg. Just nasty. What a boot. Harsh impact. Boom, what a right. Oh. A knee drop. Braun Strowman doing a great job of turning that around. He's not in a good spot here, guys. He simply needs to find a way to regroup. Oh, oh geez. Take all the wind out of you. Nailed it. Oh, <laughs> What's coming next? Taking their time. Ah, oh, punch to the gut. Take the wind right out of you. There are so many different ways for a superstar to put their opponent through the table in a tables match. Some matches start off as wild walls, and a table is brought out from under the ring, and the match is open in minutes. In others, superstars are very strategic about when they bring out a table because they know if they're not careful, momentum can be reversed, and they could end up being the one who goes through the table. And right between the shoulder blades. Byron, you talked about strategy that involves a tables match. I was in WWE when the Dudley Boys came from ECW. And you could say that things changed a bit thanks to Bubba and Devon. Something that's also important to remember in a tables match is that it's not important how or where the table is positioned. All that matters is that you put your opponent through it. It's a very simple premise, Michael, but superstars have to be careful. They launch an attack that goes awry. Their own momentum can put them through the table and cost them the match. That doesn't include feeling the incredible pain from crashing through a solid wood table. One split second can be the difference. It shouldn't be a shock that the Dudley boys were involved in one of the most intense tables matches we've seen in recent memory. At the 2015 TLC event, the Dudleys called on their extreme brothers Tommy Dreamer and Rhino to battle the Wyatt family in an eight-man elimination tables match. People were flying everywhere that night. And in classic ECW fashion, so were the trash cans and kendo sticks. Putting it all on the line. Strowman is taking no prisoners right here. Close line. Nailed it. Oh, my gosh. From what heights. Wow. I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Vicious strike. Drop kick. Beautiful. German. Big elbow. Oh, oh my goodness. Crushing it. Effectively using the knee. Big 
splash. And that one drops him. Somebody's on a mission tonight. I think we're about to see a high-risk move from the top rope. Look at this. All the way crashing down. There may be no stopping him. Got red suplex. Making it look easy. Braun Strowman's definitely doing what he can to get the psychological edge. On the back of the neck. Oh, nasty impact. Oh no, we've got a problem here, guys. No kidding, who knows what will happen next? Dangerous spot for him to be in. We gotta figure out a way to get back in it, guys. Oh, what a slam! Landed him. Spaghetti legs starting to kick in here, guys, which means we're likely nearing the end of this tables match. He doesn't want to do this outside the ring. Strowman is taking no prisoners right here. The steps connect. That hurt me just watching. Ooh, what impact. This might be it. Oh, my. Float over. Oh. And do it. I'm going to destroy your face. I don't know how much longer these superstars can avoid going through a table. You'd have to think one of them... Oh, Braun Strowman slamming into the mat. This one's over, guys. Did you see the impact on that? Wow. And he's heading back in. And here's the monster along mid. Corey, look at the... Oh, hellacious power slam. That has got to be it. Uh, yeah, there's no way this match isn't over after that one. This is a grueling championship match. Nobody wants to lose this opportunity. Oh, man. Got point of the elbow. What a stomp. Good grief. Whoa, Strowman dodged that one. He's looking a little wobbly here, guys. Michael, his legs look like they're about to give out on him. Oh, Beautiful technique. Gets him in position. This is not going to end well for him, Michael. Just dropped. I don't believe it. And that table can shorten careers, Michael. Harsh impact. Ooh! Yeah, let's hope he can keep this kind of effort going. Strowman is feeling it right here.
Oh my God, that table right there. This isn't gonna be pretty. Oh. Braun Strowman just gladly added a few pounds to his luggage by winning the title. to win for Braun Strowman. These guys look like a couple of hosses going at it out there. Great match. And folks, as a reminder, the action tonight is coming to you from one of the greatest wrestling hotbeds of all time, Minneapolis, Minnesota.